hi from my last video i asked people to send in questions on my instagram story so i've got a few questions here to answer the first one is what do i want to do at uni i want to study chemistry so i've applied to do a masters and hopefully after that i'll do a phd but we'll see that's too far away um the next question was why do i want to do a chemistry degree and why do i love chemistry and I'm not really sure how to word it without sounding disgustingly cringe, but like it explains everything. It's just like why do things have a colour? You can find that answer in chemistry. It just it's great. I really like it a lot. Um, to the extent that when I went out for ice cream with people, I was probably ruining their ice cream experience by explaining how it could have been frozen better using techniques I'd learned about in chemistry. <laughs> so the third question is do I want to take a gap year and the answer is no like I love chemistry as I've just rambled on about so I want to get to learning as much of it as I can as soon as possible. My top five uni choices was the next question so I've applied to Bristol, Durham, St Andrews, Oxford and York I'm not sure what order, like my preference is, that's why I say them in alphabetical order because I actually can't choose which one I like most. So I'll deal with that if and when I get office. <laughs> um, when am I most productive? That's definitely the morning. Like I can get on with a to-do list like from seven, but if I have lunch and I have a break, I don't want to move again until like four, like the afternoon is not for me. I think I should be allowed a nap in the afternoon every day. <laughs> Where do I study best? Not at home. My desk in my room is quite small and quite awkward because I've got not a bunk bed, but like a loft bed. So then the desk is underneath it. So it's just in a bit of an awkward space. The light isn't very good in my room, so I don't study that well so I prefer to study in school I get in from seven and leave when they kick me out at half five I'd prefer to stay later but they won't let me um, I do sometimes go to the library near me but they have such weird opening hours like they open at one on weekends and then half the day is gone and like I said I'm no good at afternoons so <laughs> not home basically is my answer what do i do to procrastinate anything literally anything quite a lot of the time i'll start playing random instruments because i know the basics on quite a lot of instruments so i'll just get one of those out like recorder i'll just start playing it and annoy my neighbors basically what do I do on an average day? So I wake up at half five and then get into school for a bit before seven so I can do an hour and a half of work for form. Then normal school day I usually have two, three lessons, sometimes four and then like it's a five period school day so the rest of those are freeze where I try to get on with as much work as I can and then, like I said, I get kicked out of school at half five after studying for a few hours. And then I come home and do a couple more hours if I can, or I'll go to different activities, clubs, whatever. Sometimes I've got meetings and things. So the last question is finally something not school related. It's what do I do outside of schoolwork? So I said before about being able to play recorder and a couple of other things to a very basic standard, but I actually get lessons in how to play flute. I'm working on grade 8 at the moment. There's a bit of confusion about entering for exams so I don't know if I'll ever take it but I'm working on the music for it and I sing in my school chamber choir and my church choir. Through my church choir I'm working on the Saint Cecilia's Award which is a bit niche. I'm not sure anyone's gonna know what that is but it's basically a singing diploma type thing. Um, I got a few questions asking about how I revise and favourite study methods so I'll post another video at some point going into that in more detail because that will take a while to get through.
Thanks for watching. Bye.